What's up you guys? It's Susan Morad right back here on Clever News and as rumors swirl around about Charlie D'Amelio and Chase Hudson aka Little Huddy's on again off again relationship, Charlie just got real as to why she's keeping her relationships private right now. Let's travel back in time to early 2020 for a second. Pre-lockdowns and everything. It was a much simpler time. And Charlie D'Amelio was on her rise to massive TikTok fame. She's now arguably the most famous person on the platform and has become a full-blown celebrity because of it. But even just earlier this year, she was still on her way up. And around the same time, she was dating fellow TikToker and Hype House member Chase Hudson, aka Little Huddy. The two dated until mid-April when they announced on their Instagram stories that they had split. Then, over the summer, there was a whole cheating scandal where Charlie called out Chase for kissing Nessa Barrett, another TikToker, despite still being emotionally involved with her at the time. We're not going to get into all of that here today, but I've linked another clever video above if you're interested in hearing about that saga. Ever since Charlie and Chase made up and moved past that drama, they've remained friends despite their past relationship and scandals. And so, naturally, fans have wondered if there was any chance of them getting back together. Charlie was even asked about this by a paparazzi in September. I think we need to normalize exes being friends. Okay. But shortly after Charlie gave that interview, eagle-eyed fans caught Charlie and Chase wearing matching rings, thinking that it could be a sign that they were back together. People wondered if this meant Charlie was lying about their relationship status and if these were promise rings. But Chase cleared the air on the whole promise ring situation. I'm not wearing anything okay. right now, but um, we, we, have a, we have a friendship ring. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. So that's just all it is? Yeah. Okay. All right. So they both doubled down on the fact that they're still just friends and that those were just friendship rings. But that didn't stop fans from continuing to speculate about these two. In a new interview with Entertainment Tonight, Charlie revealed that we probably won't be finding out much about their relationship even if they were back together. She talked about how having public relationships, especially since she's only 16 years old, can be really tough on the relationship. Honestly, having people involved in your relationships can break it. She went on and talked about how having a relationship in the public eye was actually not good for her mental health. So she plans on keeping quiet about her relationships for a while. It can really tear who you are down as a person and when you start noticing yourself getting into that sort of place where you're like, wow, these people are more invested in seeing us fail than they want to see us actually be happy together. It can be really detrimental. And we totally understand and respect that. I truly can't imagine what it's like to have your relationship under a microscope like ever, let alone when you're only 16. But fans do what fans do and continue to ship them, which doesn't seem to bother Chase and Charlie. They are still friends after all. And if you want more on Charlie D'Amelio, click right over here for another clever video. Then be sure to let me know all of your thoughts on all of this and if you ship Chase and Charlie together in the comment section below. I'm your host, Susan Morad. You can find me on Instagram at Susan underscore Morad. I'll catch you later. Bye, guys.